four, three, two, one. Hi, I'm Kristen McCulloch, and I was the first teacher in space. I was born on September 12, 1948, in Framingham, Massachusetts. My parents are Edward and Grace Corrigan, and I have four younger siblings. Growing up, my mom would look for me to help to keep the kids in line and to keep the house running smoothly. Many times I taught them life lessons just like a teacher would. That's what eventually brought me to that career. I met my husband, Stephen James McCulloch, at Framingham State College, which is where I attended college. We got married in 1970 and later had two children, Scott in 1976 and Caroline in 1979. After college, we moved to Maryland where I got my first teaching job. There I taught American history, English, and civics. After teaching for 12 years, Vice President George Bush announced a teacher in space program. Soon I filed an application along with 10,000 other teachers. Once I had heard the news that they had chosen me, I had an interview with NASA officials. Later, I had 120 days of astronaut training at the Johnson Space Center at Houston, Texas. On January 28, 1986, at Cape Canaveral, Florida, we took off in the Challenger. We were only in flight for 73 seconds when it blew up. The night before, the, drop, the temperatures had dropped below freezing, causing important parts of the shuttle's booster rockets to get damaged. That was the day I died along with my crew. Since then, I've had schools and a planetarium named after me. I've also had books written about me. 